All right, let's do this one last time. My name is Toa Legend. I made one comment on a YouTuber's toilet behavioral video, and for the last two years, I've been the one and only nibble guy. You guys know the rest. I went viral on the internet, got back to making videos, and started live streaming on Twitch. Then, I made the biggest deal I could make. A trade with the big guy himself, Jay Schlatt. The deal? The gorilla lamp that he originally offered to give me, in exchange for his own, one-of-a-kind, nibble, themed after him. One YouTube comment from him, and Project Schlibble was a go. Okay, the uh, superhero intro is getting a little cheesy, but... Here's a quick summary of what happened after that. I finished the model, but by then I couldn't get a hold of Schlatt. I wasn't sure quite what to do, so I decided to just add more onto it. Knowing that he's a Bionicle fan. Remember Bionicles? Yeah, I had more than you did, so. I really wanted to rekindle that experience for him. So once the additions were all set, it was just a matter of getting in contact with him. And even better, fate seemed to be on my side. Schlatt would be live on Twitch for the first time in years on Connor Eats Pants channel for a game show. I took this opportunity and got a message to him. Yo, Toa Legend, let me put in my calendar to sync up with you. I had done it. I was excited. I was hopeful. I was... ghosted. Again. I waited for a response after that stream. I sent him messages and emails. I even made a video seeing if I could get his attention. Which, despite its best efforts, didn't merit a response by the goat man. I was at a loss. I tried everything I could think of. Well, almost everything. There was one route left, but that... That would need something big. Something impactful. Something... Spammable. I wasn't giving up. Because you know what? No matter how many times I get ghosted... I always get back up again. Oops, sorry, got back into that superhero intro mode again. <laughs> anyway, for the next year, I expanded upon the project as much as I could. I had to make this one count. Even when he opened a P.O. box, I had to see everything through. We're now more than two years into this project. Jay Schlatt has closed his P.O. box, and the big guy still hasn't replied to any messages. But hope is not lost. This is where you come in. Oh, sorry. Got excited again. Wait, no. No, actually, bring it back. Maybe it's time to be a little excited. Today, on the 12th year anniversary of Nibble, I've prepared everything for this one final chance by sending a message the only way he and I have ever effectively communicated. By filling his comments with a repeating phrase. So, I ask of you, on whatever device you're using right now, go into his comments on his latest video, this one, and just write one word for me. Schlibble. But don't stop there. Do you have a Twitter? Tweet Schlibble. Use the hashtag, add him, whatever. Don't want to type? Easy. Retweet Schlibble. Do you only have a MySpace account? Post Schlibble on his... Wait, does he actually have a MySpace account? That was supposed to be a joke. I want to see Schlibbles invading these comment sections like cute dogs with no knowledge of social boundaries. But I know this is a big thing to ask without showing you at least a peek at what's happening. So without further ado, here's a teaser for the project. Big shout outs to my friends who did the voices at the end. You already know they're cool because without any hesitation, they recorded themselves whispering nibble and a copy pasta. <laughs> Their links are in the description below. Check them out. Schlatt, if you're watching this, first, sorry for the spam, but second, let's get this little guy to you. It's probably easiest to reach out to me on Twitter, but if you have any suggestions, I'm all yours. Just let me know. But enough from me. To everybody watching, get in his comments. We've got a schlibble to send.